Hi y'all. Thanks for dropping by Designed by Kathy. And of course, I'm Kathy. But um, today I'm going to do a uh, tip trip. Y'all, I can't say this. This will be the second blooper. <laughs> today I'm going to do a diptych. Okay, two canvases. Pour. Uh, I kept having trouble saying that, so why can't we just say two canvases? Because uh, I had to whack two bloopers before I did this one, and it, I couldn't have put it on my video. Anyway, I'm going to be using the Gen Crafts uh, acrylic ready-to-pour pouring paints. Uh, they're awesome for Dutch pours, which is what I'm going to do. But I picked out some, uh, I think, gorgeous colors. Uh, and so, uh, let me get everything ready and let's get right to pouring. So as I mentioned in the, uh, the intro, uh, if you have found doing a Dutch pours frustrating um, I'm going to suggest using these acrylic pouring paints from Gen Crafts. They are an amazingly awesome consistency for this. I'm doing a, a diptych pour here and I've got um, gray on one part and this is called well I must say vertigral a verdigris green which to me looks like seafoam green but anyway that's neither here nor there that I don't know how to pronounce it so because that happens to me a lot I don't know if it does to you guys but, but I've come across things and I remember uh, not so very long ago my little uh, niece she was like you know ain't, ain't Kathy you know why don't they just call them what they are but you know the clever names they're fun too so here is where we're going to get started. Now I'm going to use, this is Viridian. It's a darker green. Um, a pearl green, which is in their metallic set. Some copper gold, also in the metallic set. And this is a titanium white, but it's kind of a pearl. It's in the, um, it's in, also in the metallic. So I thought that would be pretty, to, a little addition there. So, let's get started here. Um, so my canvas has been prepped and ready. A little bit of water just tightens up your canvas. Then you let it dry or use your hair dryer on it because it'll, it'll dry pretty quickly. Oh, don't tell me. I have one I didn't open. Oh yeah, I did. It's just not wanting to cooperate here. Ugh. It's kind of wanting to fold. Oh, I see the problem. You know, that little deal that's in the top. We'll just get to poke that out like so. Now we're ready to go. Ooh, that's pretty. Of course, I love the copper gold. I think it's a pretty cool color. And then I'm gonna use a little of this pearly white. Okay, so I've got my dryer. I've got it set to cool, and I'm going to use the low. 
setting to start off with here. Pretty colors. So I'm gonna take uh, take my straw and see if I can blow some little areas out here. Uh, I like it. I love that. The copper, uh, copper gold. It's just pretty to me. want a little more gold up. That green is okay, but let's see if we can just just a dabby dab. You saw I added nothing to any of these paints, the base paint or the, the, the paints that we blew out. I didn't add any, any additions. I don't really like that little jobby there, but we'll fix him. So again, it's Gen Crafts. I have their link down below. They are ready to pour. 
uh, if you're gonna do like a uh, a ring pour, you'd probably want a bit, little bit of uh, triple thick in it to thicken it up just a little bit. But for flip cups, uh, I see some bubbles. Flip cups, um, straight pours, and clearly this, it, it's just perfect. Perfect. I still see, now I got a blob of gold. Uh, the, it really looks like copper to me, but. Okay, so no recipe to go with this. The paints come ready to open, ready to use. And voila, I like the colors. I do. Still, the green is a little overpowering here. Maybe I'll just try a little more here. Uh, I just didn't want the, I wanted a, that contrast of it. Didn't want it to like take over the playing field here. thing out there and add a little more but I like this love the colors and and I can't wait to see the metallics dried in this this is gonna be gorgeous uh, just nice, soft colors. Anyway, thanks for uh, stopping by. Uh, again, uh, the Gen Crafts link and information is all down below. Uh, don't need a recipe for this one. You just need the box of paint. Open and pour and have fun. So, hey guys, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to hit the like button, share button, share with your friends, share on Facebook, share wherever. And uh, if you're new, hey, I hope you'll subscribe. Uh, as well. Have a great day, everybody.